if you do find them fun, good. I'm glad. I just do not like them at all because, I don't know, I, they're just not fun to me and I'm not good at them. I should play Star Fox 64, I wonder if I would like that. I genuinely do. I played like a little bit of it once because I, I bought a Nintendo 64 once and I bought it from, or I borrowed uh, Star Fox 64 from a friend to uh, see if the Nintendo 64 worked. It did. Then I gave the game back and that was like two years ago. I still don't have any of my own games for that Nintendo 64, which is fantastic, but oh well. Nine ships left. But then, spoiler alert, there will be a second wave. Which is, once again, I may say this a lot, but it's fucking fan- or, I'm sorry, fucking, fucking, I don't know, it's just fantastic, really. Whatever you wanna, whatever ver word you wanna put in front of fantastic, effing fantastic, Wonderfuling, fantastic. I think I think the two words that they say the most are probably wonderful and fantastic. And I do not know why. It's just they're words. They're good words, I suppose. Oh, I forgot I have a boost, but I don't want it right now. I'm gonna yawn. No, I'm not. <laughs> I thought I was going to, but no, I'm not gonna yawn. I just don't have it in me. You know, sometimes you're like, I gotta yawn right now. <laughs> that was a fake yawn, by the way. I, I know it sounded really realistic, but before any of you get uh, misled, I will tell you it was a fake yawn, just to illustrate my, um, illustrate my, oh, what's the word? Uh, example? No, no, I can't think of the word. I can't think of the word. My point. My point. I couldn't think of that word. My point is, I don't remember what my point is. Because I went on a rant about what the word point is. So. That's fantastic. <laughs> Full circle. Multiple layer joke, not really. But I, I, I know I know those. Like, you know. Corn maze. That's a multiple layer joke right there. Because maze, like maze, that's what corn corn's called. And then corn... Maze, because it's a corn. I used it in the wrong context. I do apologize. Uh, oh well. Oh well. How long have I been recording for? Let's check. Uh, okay, cool. About half an hour. I think I'll do this level and then I will end. Because I don't want to record too much on my first day. Uh, what should we get out? Uh, mm, mm, I think this actually, uh, yeah, I think this has the least, or it's about the same as the gravity bomb, but I didn't get ammo for the gravity bomb. So it doesn't matter, I'm not using that. Let's just get all these bolts. Lovely bolts! Remember that from the original? Oh, sh shit. That was dumb of me. Uh, let's just, yeah. Yeah. Also, let's gamble a bit, because we're here and we can. Oh shit, the first one exploded on our first try. That is luck right there. We are some lucky beings. I think I'm going to gamble for a bit, actually, too. Just a little bit. I'll do, I'll put a, I'll put some bolts into this. How much does it cost? Like 10? I think it's about 10. Oh, nice, I got some bolts from that. Let's put some bolts into each of these. I'll put one down and then one up, if you know what I mean. So we put some down, now we'll put some going the way up. Okay, we got some more bolts from there, some more from here, it looks. Yep, we did. We got some ammo from here before, but we will get some bolts back. No nope, more ammo. Yep, okay. We can use that. I mean, yeah. And one more in here, and then we will leave, because we don't want to gamble too much. We, we have a bit of an addiction, and we do not want to fuel... Ratchet's addiction. Uh, no, I want this. Come back! Thank you. Um. Watch this. Ratchet the stealth game. Right in the butt. 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 Oh, Jesus. Right in the butt. Get him right in the butt. 
Right in the butt. Straight in the butt. Straight into Z butt. Alright. So I have something I can talk about right now. Um, last weekend I went to PAX East in Boston. And that was pretty cool, I must admit. I enjoyed it a lot. Um, it was pretty sad to leave. Unfortunately, I didn't get to actually meet any YouTubers. Um, which is very unfortunate. It's, it's just it's a few reasons why I didn't get to. I don't know if there were any real reasons, I just didn't see them. But it was pretty unfortunate, because that's one of the things I was looking forward to, but that's alright. I did get to go to two panels with, um, some YouTubers I love. So, you know, the Creature panel and then the Friend Zone panel. So those were both cool. And then I also went to the Game Over Greggy panel because a friend I have is a fan of, um, his name is Greg Miller, right? No, not Greg Miller. Is it Greg Miller? God damn it, I forget his name already. <laughs> I think it might be Greg Miller, I'm pretty sure. But that was actually a really funny panel, so I was glad I went to that. And Tim Schafer was there, which is awesome. Because if you don't know, he made... Psychonauts and you know he's from Double Fine he's made like Psychonauts and Broken Age is that you know their newest game and he was on LucasArts so he was a part of like Grim Fandango and all of those cool adventure games that they made there so he's I'm a fan of him he's really cool and yeah that was awesome I wasn't expect I didn't I didn't realize he was gonna be there but I was like oh my god he's Tim Schafer's here that's awesome and that was really cool oh let's get this uh, platinum bolt really quick oh shit nope Go go go! Oh, that was that was some pro, that was some pro stuff right there. Boss Boy J13 is now online. All right. Um, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know who that is. I did not realize I had a single friend on PSN because I played a game online like twice. I played like one game of Ratchet Up Your Arsenal. I need to play more of that multiplayer. And then I played like one game of uh. I played one game of the beta of uh, All for One once, so that's all I've played online, so I don't know who that is. I don't know if it's someone I know in real life or on the on YouTube internet or 5 Day Gamers or something. I, I admit I don't remember, so yeah. <laughs> that's that. Um, mm -hmm. And then during that rant, I thought of something else I wanted to talk about. Oh yeah, speaking of Ratchet & Clank All for One... Um, I don't want to spoil anything, but, um, expect, expect something having to do with that and a few friends from me coming soon. You know, it'll be cool. At PAX, actually, they had, um, this console free play thing where you could go, you could rent games, it was for free, but, like, you'd go to, you'd take a number, you'd go to this counter, and then, uh, when they called your number, you went up, you said, I want this game. They'd give it to you for 35 minutes, I think, was the time. And then they'd give you, um, a number of a console to go play at. So, uh, the one day we played, um, me and my two friends that I was there with, we went and played, uh, All for One. Um, and that was actually, I hated it playing single player. I played one level and then stopped. But it's actually really fun, like, multiplayer. So, yeah. That was cool, so it was, I mean, I know it was made for multiplayer, but I was just upset, obviously, because, you know, Ratchet and Clank, it's a single-player genius game, why do you make it? Yeah, but, it's cool, it's cool, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't know. <laughs> I just don't know. Also, um, I want to maybe live stream a bit more. Live streaming's cool, because... For Let's Playing, I have to sort of get ready, and, like, I have to sort of have a plan in my head for what I'm going to do. Not for what I'm going to talk about or anything, but just for, you know, like, okay, I have to play for this amount of time, I have to do this, I have to prepare. But with live streaming, I literally just, like, press a button and I'm online, like, hey, people, I'm playing this game. So I kind of, I might live stream a bit more. I've been playing a bunch of Fallout New Vegas, but I feel bad because it's not very productive playing... Fallout New Vegas and doing nothing else. So I figure I will, uh, you know, just live stream that. So ch t uh, keep watch on my um, my Twitch channel. It's just twitch.tv slash keybearer4. No big deal. But yeah, I died there because I jumped off the platform. 
I mean... <laughs> oh, Jesus. Jesus. I was so... There, was there... See... Was there seriously no checkpoint after that limo ride? I think there should have been, or it should be, because it's dumb that there wasn't. I don't know if I've ever actually, at least in the recent future, died on this level before, because I seriously remember there being a checkpoint there, but apparently there wasn't. So I'm happy. Not actually at all, but... I want a bunch of monies, at least. I sound so sad now. Oh, yeah. oh, Jesus. I just looked over at my recording, and it's actually a bit laggy. Huh. Has it been like that this whole time? I'll be right back. Sorry about that, everybody. I checked the recording, and it actually looked fine, so it must have just been my computer being dumb. So yeah, actually we should use a different weapon right now because the chopper is pretty, pretty high in XP. It's actually already sort of almost upgraded. I'm just going to use the gravity bomb on these guys. But yeah, so I'll use the gravity bomb for a bit and then I'll change over to the Lancer. And thank God I upgraded my nanotech there because I got, I was taking a bit of damage. But so yeah, I'm going to live stream a bit more. I'll probably play some Fallen in Vegas because like I said, I've been playing that a bunch, but I feel so unproductive when I'm doing it, so that's not super productive, but at least it's sort of being a doing something more than just playing a video game. And it could lead to something, maybe, I don't know. I doubt it, but I mean, it's fun anyway, so. Yeah, I kind of like live streaming a lot because it's just so much more relaxed. Like with, with the Let's Playing, I always feel obligated to constantly talk, but with live streaming, it doesn't seem as bad. Like... I find when I watch live streams, I'm less worried about like how the commentary is going, and I, it's just so much more relaxed, and I just like it a lot. So yeah, I don't know. Oh, yeah, it's just I think it's cool, just easier to watch because it is live, and so that aspect kind of makes up for any lack in commentary, or whatever. I don't know. It's like, yeah, I don't know. It's just cool. It's just cool. And I'm just using up all my gravity bombs, and I have one more, which I can use. That's... I'm not going to go back and get that. Well, fuck it. It's too far away, and I'm too lazy. That's a deadly combination, kids. Don't be lazy. Oh, I didn't... Oh, well, I forgot I picked up an ammo up there, actually. More ammo crates. Cool. I like them. I like them a lot. And let's gravity bomb. Bam! Did that get two people? No, it only got one, so it was a bit of a waste. But there's another one. Bam. I should have sent it over to the right, but oh well. I don't care. Once again. Just killing these thugs for less. Thuggy. Thuggy ba- Thuggy ba- These thuggy bastards! Look at these thuggy bastards! I don't know. I don't know. The devil is possessing me. No, no, he's not. I'm 100%. I'm 100% lying to you right now. I am 100% lying. And you know, my mom never told me lying was bad. So that's why I find it okay. I don't know if she told me it was good or bad or not. She probably told me it was bad, to be honest. But don't listen to that, honestly. I mean, do listen to it, kids, if you're... If your mom tells you that, listen to whatever your mom or dad or parental guardian says, because they they know it's they know it's best. However, for anyone a bit older than that who can speak and think for themselves, and I almost jumped off the edge again. Um, sometimes lying's necessary. For example, if someone has a gun to your throat and you don't want them to shoot you but they say the only way i will not shoot you is if you say i want you to shoot me lying and saying i want you to shoot me is okay however if you are in that situation um that's actually really bad and you should probably not say shoot me because that might go wrong i don't know what to do in that situation so don't ask me for advice and look where we're at we're at the battle arena i am ready let's get on with it man Cracking my knuckles, getting ready. It's this guy, Ratchet. It's me, 
I'm Ratchet. I'm this guy. I want the erect, erect riser. I want the erect riser. And I will not die. I will not need that grave consolation prize. I will get the electrolyzer and I will be happy with it. And guess what, everybody? Once again, it is freezing in here. <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> oof, oof, oof. Oof, look at these guys. Look at them die. Look at them die. No big deal. Two out of six rounds already. Three out of six rounds already. E. No big deal. Oh, I forgot to t talk about everything I saw at PAX. Um, I didn't see that much. But I, I mean, in the grand scheme of things. But I saw, I'll tell you some of the, um... And I don't remember everything I saw because there was, I mean, oh my god, I went by so quick. But I'll tell you some of the stuff I remember. I saw um, the crew from Ubisoft, which was cool. Um, you know, it's nothing to, like, buy an X-Gen console for, at least for me. But, I mean, it's cool if I had an X-Gen console. I, no, I, I don't know if I would get it, but I, I, if you like racing games, I'd recommend it. I suck at racing games, so yeah. I was awful at the demo. I <laughs> like... It was like, I did this off-road demo thing where, you know, you did a little race off-road and you had to look at the mini-map to get to these checkpoints, and I died really quickly, and it, it was bad. But yeah, and then it was funny because... <laughs> oh, also, I won the Electrolyzer. I'm gonna do some of these challenges, by the way. I hope you don't mind. Um, but yeah, um, actually what I might do is, I'll, I, I'll cut this here and I will make a separate video of all of the, um, I might do this if I don't remember, then I apologize, but I'll make a separate video of all of the, um, all of them, all of the, uh, arena challenges so even if it's like half an hour 40 minutes it'll be all arena challenges so you can watch it you can watch some of it you can do whatever or maybe i'll make like two 20 minute episodes or how i don't know how long it'll be but yeah i'll make it that way but yeah so if you want to skip um uh click the annotation on the screen now if i remember to do that i better so yeah if you also want to hear the rest of my, the funny anecdote I'm going to have about the crew, you may want to go and watch the direct next episode, which involves the arena challenges. So, bam, end of the episode.